Today, when I looked at the sea anemone, I noticed that there was radial symmetry. I noticed that whatever way I looked from it, I could only see the same image. It didn't look different at all. Any way I looked at it, it was always the same. Today I looked for movement of the sea anemone. After a long time of looking, I observed that there was no movement. Sea anemones are sessile. Today while I was observing my sea anemone, I noticed that the tentacles at the top moved. I don't think they moved very much, but they moved due to the water. Today when I came into class, I noticed that my sea anemone was swollen. I do not think it grew, but I think it was there was something wrong with it. Today, when I looked at the sea anemone, I noticed that it was in a polyope state. I think it's a solitary polyope because they never change. I've never seen it change while I've been observing the sea anemone. I concluded that sea anemone is a solitary polyope because of what we learned in class about cnidarians. Today, we got Harper to touch the sea anemone. When we when Harpreet touched the sea anemone, we noticed that it responded by moving the tentacles in, as in closing itself, and stinging Harpreet. Oh my god. You need to one more. It's stinky. It stings? Yeah. Aww.